Ten years ago, a General Electric turbine with 350 foot blades was considered the ultimate dream. At that time, its dimensions boggled the imagination of any engineer. But there is always room for another dream, isn't there? So the megalomania continued. In 2021, the Mingyang Smart Energy Chinese company built its Titan with blades 390 feet long each. However, this is not the limit. Wind turbines of even more unthinkable dimensions will soon become our new reality in the energy sector. And one of them is almost ready. Before we get to the story of China's new mega wind turbine, let's establish why they are constantly growing in size. And it is not just words. Turbines are getting bigger and are being installed higher and higher. Over the past quarter century, the height of towers on which wind turbines are installed has increased by 66% and amounted to more than 300 feet. This is easily explained. The higher the altitude, the stronger the wind. It has no obstacles like near the Earth's surface. Moreover, there are no trees, buildings, or mountains there. But the support structures aren't the only things becoming bigger. The blades are also increasing. If 10 years ago in America there was not a single wind turbine with a whole rotor measuring 380 feet, then in 2020 the American company General Electric created a device in which only one blade had such dimensions. The fact is that the larger the diameter of the rotor, the larger the area covered by wind turbines. This means that they catch more wind and electricity production increases. What is more, such rotors must move in a much slower manner allowing them to catch even weaker wind. That is, their area of application is becoming wider. This is especially meaningful in offshore wind production. Installing a windmill on the seabed is very difficult and costly, so the more electricity we can collect from one location, the better. That is why as long as humanity is able to technologically and organizationally create more and more huge wind turbines, it makes sense to do this. In January 2023, Chinese companies blew up the market twice with reports of giant wind turbines. First, the China State Shipbuilding Corporation announced that it had decided to challenge Mingyang. The Haizhuang H260-18MW is already in production, and its rotor measures 853 feet. That's 2.5 football fields long and the blades will be 420 feet long, 33 feet longer than the current record holder. But it only took a week for Mingyang, so to say, to strike back. They announced the construction of the MySE 18.X-28X installation, with blades 459 feet long. Frankly speaking, it is simply incredible to voice such numbers for you. But first things first. We will tell you about all the characteristics of these giants. With its 420-foot blades, the rotor of the new CSSC Haizhuang H260-18MW turbine covers about 570,000 square feet. This is 15% more than the current record holder. The area that the wind generator covers in one revolution of the rotor is comparable to 10 NFL stadiums. And with each such movement, 44.8 kilowatt hours of electricity is produced. The total capacity of the CSSC installation is 17 megawatts. However, competitors are not far behind in terms of productivity. A slightly smaller operating installation from Mingyang already produces 18 megawatts. A huge advantage of this particular project is that the installation is already under construction. In the case of Chinese companies, information is often hidden, but available videos show that most of the details have already been created. CSSC has already assembled at least one of the giant blades dubbed Super Blade Plus. In addition, a giant generator as well as transmission, support structures, and one of the biggest bearings we've ever seen is already ready. Everything looks almost ready to be assembled. Against this background, Mingyang's surprises has so far only surprised with its dimensions and announced characteristics. With blades up to 459 feet, 
the MySE 18.x 28x installation will receive 711,000 square feet of coverage, and that's 12.5 NFL football fields. Naturally, with such dimensions, the manufacturer promises that its installation will go beyond the power limit of 18 megawatts. The company believes it will be able to produce up to 80 gigawatt hours of energy per year. Unbelievable. And to completely stun everyone, the Chinese say the new wind turbine is able to cope with the most extreme ocean conditions, including level 17 typhoons with wind speeds of over 125 miles per hour. Do you know what is most interesting? It's not all about the records. Everything is ruled by profitability and savings. Each such installation saves at least half a million dollars on construction. To be more precise, costs are reduced by $120,000 to $150,000 per megawatt of power. We wonder how big wind turbines will get before we hit the limit. Will this be the point where the blade tips become supersonic? Will they be limited by the size of the production sites or logistics? Will they last as long as the smaller turbines given the gigantic loads? Will they be cheaper in the long run, given that the failure of one unit greatly reduces the capacity of the entire farm? Find out for sure by subscribing to our channel.